Oh, I should have warned you, Odie. Garfield's in a bad mood today. Well, worse than usual. Oh, for one thing, it's Monday. As you know, there's nothing that scares Garfield more than a Monday. Please don't let today be Monday. Please don't let today be Monday. Please, please, please. Please don't let today be Monday. And then what followed was bad even by Monday standards. He had something planned. Some new way to torment the mailman. He'd been looking forward to it all morning. But then, when the mailman arrived, Herman the Mailman had come up with a method of Garfield-proof mail delivery. You won't get me this time, cat. The mail got delivered and there was nothing he could do. Then, things got worse. He went to Vito's for pizza. No, no more pizzas for you. Not until I am paid for the last 7,432 you have eaten here! And when he got back, he got maybe the worst news of all. Normal had come for a visit. A long visit. And now, here comes the worst part. I have to tell him he's gaining weight, and I'm putting him on a diet. I know. If you think those other things upset him, wait till you see his reaction to this news. But it has to be done, so I know you won't like it, but I'm putting you on a strict diet, and that's final. Please don't hurt me. <laughs> doing. He brought some junk from the city dump or somewhere and he's been in the garage for an hour building something. He just... Oh, wait. Oh! He's built some sort of invention or something. I have no idea what it does. And I'm worried. Garfield has some sort of machine there. I wonder what it does. Well, whatever it is, it can't be good for me. Oh, Pussycato. What is that machine he has there? What could he possibly do? I have a very bad feeling about this. Uh-oh. What is that thing? Why am I not gonna like what it does? Hmm. That machine of his, it's gotta have something to do with my new tank. Some way of tormenting me in spite of it. I can only imagine what he's gonna do next time I show up in that tank. <laughs> the most fiendish contraption he's ever devised. I have to stop him before he uses it on me. Vito, where's that pizza we ordered? Uh, coming oh. right up, senor. 
What could that machine possibly do? I have learned to never underestimate that pussy gatto. Maybe, maybe it will make uh, the pizza and the, not just any pizza, but pizza up to the Garfield standards. Oh. <laughs> Hello. Uh. What kind of pizza would you like to make today? Thin crust or thick? What do I want to do today? Let's see. You have selected thin crust. Would you like small, medium, or large? <laughs> you have selected extra, extra, super jumbo <laughs> large. Would you like extra cheese? Yes. Extra sauce? Yes. Pepperoni? Yes. Sausage? Yes. Anchovies? No. Meatballs? Yes. A side of pasta? Yes. A side of cheeseburgers? Yes. Some Chinese food? Yes. Thank you. Your pizza will be ready <laughs> in 15 seconds. <laughs> no. That takes too long. Mm. Oh man, I gotta speed this thing up. <laughs> Cooking pizza at 1,000 degrees. Your pizza is done. Um, the greatest scientific breakthrough of this or any other century. <laughs> I, I am unnecessary. And I'm coming to you live from the hottest new pizzeria in town. It's called Garfield's. People have been coming from around the world for Garfield's pizza. Some, it is said, have been waiting in line since early August. <laughs> and two words. Delicious! This is the best pizza ever made anywhere. No, it's ever Oh, oh, please. Uh, you come in. You have a slice. <laughs> I'm ruined. I haven't sold the pizza since Garfield went into business. Now, I am out of a business. Out of my way. I've got to get to Garfield. No, stop. Hold on. No, please. No. Hey. It was just my imagination. But it could happen. I must make certain it does not happen! Oh, I'm really worried, Odie. You've got to tell me what Garfield's machine does. Oh. But then, <laughs> what can he do to me? Mail me to Abu Dhabi? He's already done that to me 73 times. Oh, oh right, 74. But what if he doesn't send me to Abu Dhabi? What if he sends me to... someplace worse than that? Don't do this, Garfield! Whatever it is you're gonna do, don't do it! Will you please calm down? You'll like Alpha Centauri. Alpha Centauri? You're gonna put me in a rocket? Well, how else am I gonna get you there? Oh, no! No, 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 no! I'm the cutest kid in this world, and I want to stay in this world. <laughs> ah! <laughs> well, I didn't want to have to do this the hard way, but he's forced me. Here we go. <laughs> Seven. <sighs> I can't wait that long. Blaster! I can't explain now, Odie. I have to stop Garfield from sending me in outer space. <clears throat> I'm leaving, Garfield. I'm huh? leaving. Ooh, I like the sound of that. I'm not staying for months. I'm <laughs> gonna go home. Bye-bye. Uh, wow, he left fast. I got rid of the tank, Garfield. Huh? You don't have to use this machine on me. You don't even have to fling me into the mud hole. Look, I'll do it for you. <laughs> See? <laughs> How I love to wind up in a good mud hole. <laughs> 
Garfield, <laughs> Vito is so sorry he kicked you out of his restaurant this morning. Here, have pizzas. Lots and lots of pizzas. Just uh, don't start making them yourself, okay, please? <laughs> Garfield, I was worried about what your machine here... Uh, I mean, I was worried about your health, and I was thinking maybe you don't need to diet. <laughs> and I see you've already come to the same conclusion. <gasps> okay. Pay no attention to what I said. I never do. Mm. Huh? What's that, boy? You want to know what my machine really does? This machine does the same thing I'm going to do for the rest of the day. Absolutely nothing. Hmm. You know, I could even get to like Mondays. to scream, Audrey. No one can hear you. Get out of the house, Audrey. Get out of the house while you still can. She's on TV. She can't hear you. And by the way, I'm on TV and I can't hear you either. I heard that. But I saw a ghost, Greg. <laughs> you couldn't possibly have seen a ghost. I know how horror movies work. She'll be safe until she asks, how can you be sure? I trust you, Greg. How can you be sure? Here it comes. Because I'm the only ghost here. <laughs> I love to watch horror movies with John and Odie. They never touch their popcorn. I can't watch another second of this. I hate ghost stories. They terrify me. Nothing scares me. Except maybe anchovies on pizza. <laughs> <laughs> oh, something will scare you, cat. Something's gonna scare you real good. <laughs> Now, Pookie, while John's away, I'm going to teach you how to make the perfect sandwich. The secret lies in two essential points, quantity, and more importantly, quantity. A true work of art, wouldn't you agree, Pookie? Oh, Pookie? Odd. I would have sworn Pookie was sitting next to me. How'd you get over here? Oh, my sandwich. Odie, bad dog. You ate my sandwich. Huh? Come on. You're here and the sandwich isn't. Therefore, you ate it and I'll prove it. There will be crumbs and residues of ham, cheese, tomato, pastrami. Hey, that's weird. Not a single trace of food. Whew. But you could use a mint. So, if you didn't eat the sandwich, who did? <laughs> a ghost? You think we're being haunted by a ghost? As usual, empty. Listen, Pop. Ghosts only exist in movies and TV shows. They don't exist in the real world. Buddy, remember a moment ago I said, this is no time to panic? <laughs> that wasn't. This is. Ah! 
I never cared much for that chair. And we can do without that table. And we don't need... No! Not the TV! Boy, that was close. What would I ever do without you? You think I know how to make a mess? This guy knows how to make a mess. Oh. Hey, ghost, I know you're here, you mean home wrecking spineless spook. You don't scare me. Okay, ghost, no need to get angry, I get the picture. <laughs> I know that laugh. Where did I hear that laugh before? Garfield, Odie, I'm home. <laughs> I'm going to fix myself a snack and go right to my office and go to work. He didn't notice. <laughs> he noticed. What did you do? I mean, I, I, how, I, 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 how could you? Hey, we didn't do this. I've been framed. <laughs> <laughs> What? Are you trying to tell me a ghost did this? That's the lamest excuse I ever heard, and I have no choice but to punish you. Punish us? Okay, guys, it's time for dinner. I'll have the Caesar salad to start, dressing on the side, then the shrimp cocktail followed by French onion soup with extra cheese, corn on the cob with extra butter and a side of lasagna. For dessert, apple pie with mint chip ice cream and a couple of seven layers. There you cakes. go. <laughs> Kitty witty dry cat food made from all artificial ingredients. <laughs> this is not what I ordered. That's all huh? you're getting for the next year. Bon appetit. A year? I can't take a year of this. I can't take a mouthful. Who could be stupid enough to eat this? <laughs> He's not getting away with this. I demand food. <laughs> okay, John, you wanna play? I'm game. Don't bother, Garfield. This kitchen is burglar-proof and Garfield-proof. <laughs> oh well, at least the food is better here. Huh? That laugh again. I know I've heard it before. It's like it came from one of the houses across the street. Nathan? Huh? Lunch is ready. Coming, Mother. I know who the ghost is. It's it's Nathan, that bratty science geeky kid across the street. The kid who shrunk me to the size of a mouse. The kid who cloned Odie into 12 dogs with the collective brains of a hockey puck. The kid who turned Nermal into a cockroach. Can you believe that? Someone actually found a way to make Nermal more annoying? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Told ya. Journal, my invisibility machine is working to perfection. Phase one, getting back at that stupid orange cat and that dumb huh? puppy was a total success. <laughs> and now, phase two, to terrorize the entire neighborhood, and then the city, and finally, the whole wide world. <laughs> Nathan, your lunch is getting uh -huh. cold. Coming, mother. Let's see how this thing works. <laughs> ah! Okay, the green button makes you invisible. Let's see what happens when I push the white button. Okay, got it. White button reverses it. Thanks for lunch, oh. Mo. I'm gonna eat in my huh? lap or a uh, room. Uh-oh, green button time. I'll eat as soon as I finish rearranging the world's time zones. Mmm, spaghetti. Mmm, boy. Nathan's mother raised a rotten kid, but she sure makes a mean marinara. Done. Now for my lunch. 
Mm. Oh, well. I don't have time for lunch now. And now let's go out and wreak havoc in the neighborhood. <laughs> Over my invisible body. Ouch! What was that? That was for the stupid orange cat, and this is for the <laughs> dumb puppy. Hey, whoever you are, you're going to be sorry you did that. Ouch! Time out! I need to catch my breath! I'm a geek, not an athlete! Well, if you're feeling tired, why don't you grab a chair? Ha! You missed! <laughs> On guard! <laughs> 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 Timber! Ouch! That hurt. Nathan? What's going on here? Nathan! Oh, what happened? Nathan, where are you? He's right here. Oh. Nathan, what on earth have you been up to again? I built an invisibility machine. That's what geniuses like me do, Mom. We build cool stuff. Oh, yeah? And how does your genius account for your destroyed room? <laughs> See ya, Nathan. There! It was that stupid orange cat who wrecked my room. I don't see any cat. It was Garfield Honest. He used my machine to make himself Enough. invisible. And I'm sick and tired of your inventions. Ah! So much for your silly oh, no! ability machine. Yeah, no buts. Now, well, I guess that takes care of the boy genius. Now let's look into the dining situation at home. Oh, I'm sorry, Odie, but you don't get any pizza. You and Garfield are only getting dry food for a year. That'll teach you to try and convince me that our house was wrecked by ghosts. <laughs> what a silly fib. <laughs> now, if you could convince me that there were ghosts, I'd believe you. But we all know there are no such thing as... Ghosts! Help! Ghosts! My house is haunted! Help! Pizza eating ghosts! Hi, Odie. It's me. Oh, wait. I'll explain it to you after I finish my pizza. Boy, this was a great episode. The animators must have especially loved it. They probably took the week off. Mmm. You know, I've always kind of liked ballet dancing, but do they have to do it when I'm trying to sleep? Very good. Now, time for today's lesson, ladies. Welcome to ballet dancing for mice and other small rodents. Today, oh. we shall cover pirouettes, place the feet slightly <laughs> about, raise the arms, and give it slowly. I live to dance. Yeah? Well, some of us live to eat, and eat to live. Where's Vito with my 11.30 a.m. pizza delivery? Did you ever have the feeling that you were being watched? Good. I have a clear view into the house where it looks like. <laughs> Ballet dancing mice. 11.30 a.m. I'm monitoring the Arbuckle home looking for a proper test subject for my new invention. Ah, the pizza delivery man, the perfect test subject. First, I need to seize control of his mind. <laughs> I must hurry. Mr. Arbuckle's cat does not like it when his 11.30 a.m. pizzas arrive 10 seconds late. Ah. <laughs> It's working! I've seized control of his mind. 
You hate delivering pizzas. You will no longer deliver pizzas. I will no longer deliver pizzas. Hey, it's 11.30 and 10 seconds. Where are my pizzas? No, no pizzas for you. No pizzas for anyone. <gasps> Words I hoped I'd never hear. I hate delivering pizzas. I hate making pizzas and delivering pizzas and everything about the pizzas. I will never make another pizza as long as I live. I will never make another pizza as long as I live. Ah, Vito, say it isn't so. Throw them on the ground. Stomp on them. Here, here is what I think of pizzas. Down with pizzas. No, no, no. <laughs> at last! At last I'm getting revenge on that cat for ruining my plans for world domination! Testing a mind control device, unqualified success. I press the blue button, capture someone's mind, then speak into the microphone to tell them what to do. Nathan! Nathan! Oh no. Not now! Mom! I'm working on a plan to conquer and enslave mankind! That can wait, Nathan! First, you have to take out the garbage and do your chores. But, Mom! Don't you butt mom me, young man. Garbage first, enslaving mankind second. Oh, these kids today. Where are their priorities? Take the garbage out yourself, Mom! I will take the garbage out myself, Mom. <laughs> the effects will only last a few days before they wear off. All right, now, let's see if my invention will work on that dog that lives with the cat. Hmm. My invention has no effect on the dog named Odie. I'll try someone else. Wow, he'll do fine. Hmm, it's a little after 11.30. I'd better start making lasagnas for today. You don't like cats. You don't want any cats in your house, especially Garfield. I do not like cats. What could have caused Vito to do such a horrible thing? I can't think of anything worse that could happen. I do not like cats. <laughs> I do not want any cats in my house. Huh? Especially Garfield. <laughs> I thought of something worse. No! <laughs> yes! John can't be serious. <laughs> John, what are you doing? Where are you throwing away all of my favorite foods? This is a whole box of crunchy poodle doodles. This is the perfect cereal. It's loud, it has no nutritional value whatsoever, and it turns milk purple. From now on, I only serve one food in this house. Raisins. Raisins? Raisin pie, raisin bread, raisin stew, meatloaf, but with raisins instead of the meat. No, no, no. You can't be serious. No, no, you can't be serious. If you want cereal, you may have raisin bran, but without the bran. Which reminds me. <laughs> this still can't be happening to me. <laughs> I can't. I still do not like cats. <sighs> oh, this day is not going well at all. Why does John suddenly not like me? I'm lovable. Or as lovable as I ever was. Garfield Cat. Uh -oh. I hate Garfield oh. Cat. Are you Garfield Cat? <laughs> Too bad. I hate Garfield Cat. Garfield the Cat, I hate you. I don't know why I, 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 I just do. <laughs> what? <laughs> Booty, do you hate me? <gasps> do you like me? <laughs> Great. I don't know what got into John. Vito not making pizzas. That's like Vito not making pizzas. <laughs> Hmm. <gasps> the mailman. With my luck today, he's probably returning Nermal from Abu Dhabi. Postage due. <laughs> oh, what a joy it is each day to deliver the mail. <laughs> okay, here's what I want you to say. I hate delivering the mail, 
I'm going to move to Spain and become a beautiful senorita. <laughs> I hate delivering the mail. I'm going to move to Spain and become a beautiful senorita. <laughs> I can make anyone do whatever I want! Mom, take out more garbage! <laughs> see, Orita. Odie, did you see? He started acting odd after he was hit by some sort of ray from across the street. That's the house where that bratty mad scientist, Nathan! <laughs> Come on! I must take out the garbage as ordered. I will rule the world! Everyone will take orders from me! The most powerful man alive! But first I have to go to the little boy's room. <laughs> oh, this must be it. Some sort of mind control machine. I guess. What's this thing? My invention has no effect on the dog named Odie. Of course not. You can't control someone's brain if they don't have one. Let's go back. The effects will only last a few days before they wear off. And back a little more. Testing a mind control device, unqualified success. I press the blue button, capture someone's mind, then speak into the microphone to tell them what to do. Odie, that's the secret. Do you realize what this means? It means I can control the world. I can make everyone do exactly what I want. I can make every single person on the planet get into the pizza delivery business. I can make the governor proclaim every day, Garfield the Cat Day. And I further decree that everyone has to give Garfield the Cat a nice gift. He'll accept cash, checks, and all major credit cards. I can sleep all day and I can sleep all night. Wait a minute, I already do that. I can make Normal, Drusilla, Minerva, and Aunt Ivy all move to some other show. Eh, we're gonna go annoy the people on the six o'clock news instead. Oh. I can have the entire planet re-sculptured so it looks like a giant replica of my head. Okay, so we'll have it orbited by a moon that looks like you. All I have to do is push the blue button and talk into the microphone, and then, Odie. We have a problem. I can't talk. Huh? I'm a cat, remember? Humans can't hear me. Except for those people out there. Microphones can't either. Ah. And I was so looking forward to making the world look like me. What are you doing <laughs> in my lab? Every time I invent something, you come along and ruin my plans! I just want to rule the world and make everyone my slaves! Is that so awful? Uh, yeah, it is. Well, I won't let you! I'll use my disintegration ray! <laughs> There's nowhere to hide, Cat! Prepare to be disintegrated! Ooh, I don't like the sound of that. <laughs> I could control that mind of his if I could give him an order into this microphone, but I can't. But I know who can. We just need to borrow something from across the street. Welcome to belly dancing for mice and other small rodents. That would include Nathan. Put your hands over your head, stand on point, then move in time to the music. That'll keep him busy for a few days until the ray wears off. <laughs> What's to stop him from using his mind control device when it does wear off? This. It took three seasons, but we finally got some culture into the show. Oh yeah. I took the disintegration ray. I thought it might come in handy the next time we have a guest appearance by Aunt Ivy.
come back here. Boy, you. Come on now, boy. You leave me alone, Garfield. You just resent me because I'm so adorable. You won't be after I get through with you. <laughs> Mew. And don't come back. <sighs> envy. Pure envy. Hey, pal. Yeah. Do you mind? Some of us have to eat out of these things. Oh, sorry, Harry. <laughs> Garfield threw me in there because he's so jealous of me. <sighs> not that I blame him. Garfield's not jealous of you. Look at this. Somebody threw away a perfectly good six-week-old tuna sandwich. <clears throat> How could he not be jealous? I'm cute. I'm beloved. I have everything. You don't have your own show. What? Garfield has his own show. We're on it right now, see? People are watching us. <laughs> oh, yeah. Hiya, folks. Everyone watches it. You can hear it coming out of almost every house. The little girl who lives here watches it every time it's on. Hey, I told you to watch educational programs. The Garfield Show is educational, Mom. I'm learning how to eat lasagna and sleep all day. Right, all right. We're speaking with the noted inventor and mad scientist, Professor Thaddeus Bonkers. Professor Bonkers, is it true you've invented a time machine? Oh, that is correct. How long did it take you? The rest of my life. I actually finished it 47 years from now. But then when I was done, I jumped into my time machine and came back here to today in it. Oh. Huh. So in your time machine, someone can actually travel into the past. Indeed. But they have to be very careful. Anything you do when you are back in time could affect the future. Wow. What would you do if you had a time machine, Harry? I think I'd go back in time about two minutes and not eat this sandwich. Well, I know what I'd do. And what I'm gonna do. <laughs> a slight change of history, and this show will be mine. <laughs> So, you need to be very careful about altering the past. This is boring. I'm gonna watch the Garfield show. Garfield, you can't just lay around the house all day sleeping. John's right. I'll lay around the backyard all day sleeping. <laughs> you are to guard my time machine with your life. It is priceless. It took me the rest of my life to build it. Yeah, you can count on me, Professor. this thing. Traveling through time for dummies. <laughs> Just what I need. To start, press red button. Well, doy. How to stop, how to stop, how to stop. Oh, it's gotta be in here somewhere. Duh, duh. Selecting a date or event to visit. Awesome. <laughs> I'm setting it for the day John first found Garfield at the pet store. <laughs> wow, I made it. That's the store. So how do you get someone to adapt you? Just look adorable, and then someone will want to take you home. Well, that doesn't sound so hard. It helps if the human isn't too bright. Hey! Oh, he should be a cinch. Uh, but don't look too eager. It makes them think no one else wants you. Good idea. I'll play hard to get. <laughs> May I help you, sir? Uh, yes. I've been thinking I might like to adopt a cat. Take me, oh, take me home with you. Please, please, please. I'll be your loyal cat. Oh, meow, meow, meow. Pick me. Wow. Uh, maybe a 
I'll take this one. That's how John adopted Garfield. On the way home, I'll stop off at the market and buy some cat food. Actually, we've noticed that he rather likes lasagna. Lasagna? Meow, meow. Okay, lasagna. <sighs> you are kind of cute. You're not so bad yourself, Bella. I think we're going to be good. <gasps> And you're going to love it at my place. I'll fix you up a bed and feed you whatever you like. <laughs> this is weird. I feel like the entire universe just shifted a little. Oh well, time for my 315 pre-dinner appetizer booster snack. Gee, John's not keeping the kitchen as well stocked as he usually does. It's every pet for himself at dinner, Odie. Oh, there's barely enough food in the house for me. Huh? <coughs> what? An intruder? Where? <coughs> you mean me? How could I be an intruder? What do you mean you never saw me before in your life? I'm Garfield. I live in this house, remember? See my picture right over here on... <gasps> Normal. What is Normal doing in my picture frame? <laughs> Squeak, tell Odie who I am. Strange cat in the house. Alarm, alarm. Squeak, it's me, Garfield. You're a cat. I can't beat mice. Oh, except for my friend Normal. Normal? <laughs> hey. What's wrong, Odie? Huh? Hey, how'd that cat get in here? That cat? John, oh, don't you remember me? The cat who sleeps all day, who eats lasagna, who's been with you since... When did Jim start the newspaper strip? 1978. Since 1978? I don't know who you are, but there's only room for one cat in this house. My beloved pet, Normal. <gasps> Normal, you're bad. <laughs> what happened? Why do I no longer exist? Odie doesn't know me. Squeak doesn't know me. Even John doesn't know me. This couldn't be any worse. Lorraine, <gasps> are you watching the Normal Show again? The Normal Show? It's just starting, Mom. <laughs> No, that's my show. That's my opening and my theme song. Those people with the funny names in the credits, they work for me. Me! Lorraine, I told you to watch something educational. The normal show is educational, Mom. I'm learning how to be the most oh. adorable creature on the planet. <laughs> my show. He even got my show. My life. My show. I'm surprised I still have my stripes. Hi, Garfield. Oh, hi, Normal. Normal! Normal, what have you done? Done? About what? Why do you suddenly have my life and my show? Oh, that. Oh, <laughs> no big deal. I just borrowed a time machine, went back in time, and got John to adopt me instead of you. <laughs> See you later, Garfield. <gasps> oh. So that's how he did it. Hmm. Time machine! How am I going to undo this? How am I going to get my life back? Professor Bonkers, is it true you've invented a time machine? Yes, uh, two of them, in fact. Someone stole the first one, they left it in a no parking zone in the past, and it oh. was towed. The police have no idea what it is, so I had to build another one. I have to get that time machine and undo what Nermal did. <laughs> And you're going to love it at my place. I'll fix you up a bed and feed you. No, stop! 
You're making a terrible mistake. You don't want that cat. He's obnoxious. He's annoying. He's, he's, he's normal. What is it, cat? Are you telling me I shouldn't adopt this one? Yes, yes. Take the little cute one who eats lasagna. He's the one you really want. Don't do this. Please. Please. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a pretty good life Garfield has. Or rather, had. <laughs> I'm starting to really enjoy it. <laughs> Nermo, what are you doing here? I live here. Not anymore. I went back in time and convinced John not to adopt you. What? That's right, Garfield. How dare you do to me what I did to you? Come with me. Let's see how things are now in the Arbuckle household. You're such a wonderful pet, Odie. I'm so glad I decided never to get a cat. Never, never to, to get, get a, a cat. cat? Shall we watch our favorite TV show? Hey. <laughs> Okay, here it comes. The Odie Show! Don't worry, folks. We'll go back and get this straightened out before the next episode of The Garfield Show. Or The Normal Show. Or whatever the show is. The most important meal of the day. Unless you count lunch, afternoon snacks, evening snacks, midnight snacks, 1.30 in the morning snacks, 1.45 in the morning snacks. Garfield, if you damage my brand new smartphone, I'll be very angry. Smartphones are great. You can listen to music, take pictures, make movies, surf the internet. And who knows, maybe one day they'll do important things, like make lasagna. <laughs> Cody chasing his tail. This could be a sensation on the internet. Hmm. <laughs> and cut. Let's check it out. <laughs> I'm gonna post the video I just shot online for the entire world to enjoy. Oh, and they will. They will. <laughs> this is gonna be good. Wow, my video of John has had almost a million hits in 20 minutes. Have you guys huh? seen my phone? <gasps> nope. Uh -huh. <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> It's got to be around here someplace. Phew, you almost blew it, Odie. How do I get rid of this pooch for a while? Hey, Odie, want to play fetch? See this? Fetch! Uh, this should keep him busy until halfway through the next episode. Now, I need a new John video for the internet. Please, John, do something stupid. Oh, come on, John, please do something stupid. Huh? <laughs> 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 Better start making dinner. Gotcha! Uh. <laughs> 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 
This is great. I gotta get away from here. I'm gonna take a drive. This has not been a very good day. And cut. Ooh, I have to get this on the internet right away. Yikes! Hello? Oh, hi, Liz. John, have you been having a bad day? As a matter of fact, yes. How did you know? Well, turn on the TV and watch the news. Oh, and are we still having dinner in a little while at Vito's? Of course. Good. If you just tuned in, here are some videos of silly accidents that were <laughs> posted on the again? internet earlier today. <laughs> They're called the, the Arbuckle Chronicles. And they've had more than 50 million hits in the last 12 hours. <laughs> <laughs> You did this, Garfield, and you did it with my smartphone. Huh? Don't deny it, and give me back my smartphone. You want to play games, huh? I am dialing the number of my smartphone. <clears throat> wow. Now, how did that get in there? You think this is funny, don't you? Hmm. I will deal with you later. Right now, I have to go meet Liz for dinner. Oh, John was so upset. I've never seen him so angry. I wish I had a video of it to post. Come on, let's follow him. Hey, isn't that the silly man we saw on the internet? It sure is. <laughs> Hope your car doesn't fall apart again. <laughs> John Arbuckle. Oh, I want to thank you. Thank me? For what? For what? For what? Because of your videos. I am no longer the biggest laughing stock on television. And I gotta tell you, boy, I thought I'd look stupid. And then I saw your video. <laughs> I know what stupid is. <laughs> <laughs> Don't fall off the chair, John. Here's your menu. Better decide what kind of food you're going to spill on yourself. <laughs> oh, oh, Senor Arbuckle, welcome. And uh, my brother in Rome says to say hello. Your brother in Rome knows me? He's the one who sent me the link to your hilarious videos. <laughs> he said everyone in Italy is laughing at you. I mean, I, 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 no, <laughs> they're laughing at me. Uh, let me go get you some minestrone. Excuse me, are you the clumsy, dumb guy in the Arbuckle Chronicles videos? Yes. Oh, you look so stupid in them. Would you do the skateboard routine again oh. for us? Oh, yes, yes. do it! The oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay, that's it. I've had enough of this. I'm leaving. <laughs> you people should be ashamed of yourself, laughing at someone else's misfortune. Now. I like a joke as much as the next guy, but there's nothing funny about accidents, about people falling down and possibly hurting themselves. There's nothing funny! Oh my, you think this has gone too far, Odie? Ooh, I have to put this right. I mean, despite being rather dumb, John is a very nice owner and a good provider. He doesn't deserve this. And I think I know how to fix this. You wait here. I need something. 
just don't get any better looking than this. Be normal. I'm on my way to audition for a flea collar commercial. After all, uh, I am the cutest kitty cat in the whole <laughs> wide world. Well, too bad you're not the most famous. What do you mean? I'm not the most famous. You're not very famous. You're not even as famous as John. John? John, the guy who feeds you? He's not famous. You think so, huh? Listen to the buzz on the street. Have you heard the latest on John Arbuckle? Arbuckle, that's the John name. John Arbuckle. 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 How did John get to be so famous? I put him in one of my videos. Millions of people Ooh. see them. Wow, millions of people? Garfield, could you put me in one of your videos? <laughs> could you, could you, could you? Well, I might find a way to use you. Just leave everything to me. <laughs> John Arbuckle's 15 minutes of fame are already history. <laughs> <sighs> Thank goodness. A new internet sensation has taken the world by storm. <laughs> Normal, the <but don't... laughs> <laughs> 120 million hits in the last 24 hours. <laughs> Brace yourself. I laughed so hard, I broke a rib. <laughs> 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 Poor Normal. On the other hand, everyone's forgetting about me. Hi, hey, Normal. Ready to shoot another video for the internet? Are you out of your tree, Garfield? You made me look ridiculous. You made me look like an idiot. I will never in a million years be in one of your videos. Okay, have it your way. Come on, Odie, I'll make you look dumb instead. <laughs> Ugh, I can't believe Garfield. Imagine thinking I'd be in another one of his videos after what he did to me. Abigail, isn't that the cat in the video? It is. It's normal. Normal, we love you in that video. You do? We sure do. Oh, that's normal. Where? Hey, normal? Hey, normal. Hey, normal. Oh, I love normal. Hey, normal. Hey, normal. Hey, normal. <laughs> Come on, do something stupid, Odie, like trip or fall in the mud, anything. Ah, it's no use, it's just too boring. Don't stop shooting, Garfield! Woo! I'll be in your video. See, I have a stupid hat on, and I'll fall in the mud. Watch. Oh, and then maybe I could fall out of a tree. Oh, oh, or I'll put on clown makeup or get my feet stuck Normal thinks he's the most famous cat in the world. But let's not forget uh, whose name is on this show. La, 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 la.